Hello, Christiana, and welcome to Monday Magic. Hello, Pia. <laughs> I'm so happy you would come here and have a talk to me with what you know and what's possible out in the world. And I, I brought the world. <laughs> yes. That's and and awesome. some of the world behind there. <laughs> I only brought, um, like, you know, that. Do more of what makes you happy. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> and I know that I am breaking the rule of it's supposed to be Danish this week. Oh, a rule breaker. But, well, that would be me. And um, so I'm just going to say a quick. Hi in Danish. <laughs> så hej alle sammen og velkommen til Mandas Magi. Og ja, elsker jeg at bryde reglerne. Så i dag, der har jeg det simpelthen også på engelsk, for jeg har inviteret Christiane Hej til at komme og snakke lidt om at vinde og tabe og ikke til. Ja, så lyt med og se hvad I får ud af det, og ellers så kan I få energien af det, fordi det kan vi ikke lade være med at være. So I just let them know that we're going to talk a little about winning, losing, and not counting. And also that if they don't get it, we'll be an energy anyway, so they can see what they get. We can't stop it. So I, no, I, can't, I can't stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I beat <read> anyway. <laughs> so actually, this is uh, something that we talk about uh, in The, in the foundation class, access foundation class. Um, and if you want to know more about the access foundation class, you can find it on accessconsciousness.com slash foundation. And I can put it in the notes too. Um, but it's one of the things we talk about with relationship. And what interests me more than relationship to others, because we all know that, that's interesting, uh, is I started to look at the relationship with me. Uh, and I know if I have a functioning relationship with me and my body, and I know you love to talk about bodies. So um, when I have that, <laughs> yes, yes you <laughs> yeah, your body starts smiling at technology. And when I start to, uh, looking at that and having a great relationship there uh, with me, then I can go out and have relationship and find relationships that also work with others. So this is actually it. Um, so we have three things that we're looking for, a question we can ask ourselves. So how do I function? Am I a winner? And I'm a loser? A am I a loser? Or am I just a no count? Somebody you don't count for anything, you don't notice or anything. And you can ask yourself this. So let me just say quickly what a winner is, like described as a winner is, well, you probably know it. They'll always go for the for the win. They will look for the greatest things. They were always like they would trump people down and they will get whatever is in the way. If you ever played a game with a winner that wants to win, you know the energy. And if you are one, you also know the energy. I got to win. And then there's the others, the losers. They will give up the win anytime just to be with you. They'll give up themselves, they'll give up anything. And then there's no counts. They will not give up themselves. And they will not have you give up you. And this is what I like to take into what it is for ourselves when we look at this. What does that mean? That was a long speech. <laughs> And an unexpected um, explanation for the no count, because wh when you normally, when you hear no count, it's an e equivalent for a loser. Actually, it's a judgment in this reality yes. so yes so not not from the the reality where access consciousness where we look at what is we we're just not 
in the equation. It's kind of like if you if you're not willing to give yourself up, but you don't fight. And if you're not willing to like sacrifice another, <laughs> uh, but honor them and let them do whatever they like, then you're not counted on the playing, you know, on the playing board. You simply have to be willing to get out of the way <laughs> or, or go for the kill in this reality and how we live in the world. And this is what I would like to offer and invite people to look at what's possible if we changed it and we actually acknowledged what it gives us if we don't give up us and we don't ask the others to give up themselves. So the loser part, um, is this kind of equivalent with um, being a victim? Yes. Okay. So I know yeah. all of all three of them. Me too. <laughs> Yeah, I was a great loser for many years. <laughs> I would let everyone win so they could be happy. And if we take that on a bigger scale, I would give up everything that I was to live their reality. Like, so if you said, Pia, let's have a cup of tea, and I desired coffee, I would say, okay, let's have tea. <laughs> Because it would make you happy. I'm so, sorry, I just remembered your talk. You're telling me that it's so. <laughs> it's sometimes very challenging to go eating or to go out with me to have dinner. Yes. Because <laughs> then I'm a total, I'm a winner and I'm a no count at the same time. I'm not willing to step down. Actually, Yes, what you talk about there when we go out for dinner and you say, I will have this for my body, that's being a no count. That's not being a winner. That is you not giving up what works for you and your body. No matter what I desire to eat, you will go where it works for you. And it's my, and you, it's totally my choice if I choose to eat the same place. Well, yes. <laughs> yes. That is from a no composition. It does not mean that you will, like, that's not bullying. If you said to me, I'm having this and you must have it too, that would be a winner. Or I know what you need to eat. I know your body needs to eat this. That would be a winner's point of view that I know what's best for us. Okay, no, I won't, never. <laughs> no, and that's the thing. I, I, that's why I love having this conversation with you because I have chosen to be that loser for so many years and give up my life. And then sometimes I would meet somebody who also had that loser role. <laughs> And we would actually get into a fight of winning. <laughs> Who was the best loser? <laughs> How funny. I can, I can give myself up more than you can. <laughs> you know, look at me. I'm suffering more than you are. And, and, and so can you see, it's ridiculously funny to me today. It was a lot of trauma and drama before, but it's ridiculously funny. Like, how much can we go into a fight of who's who's right about being wrong? <laughs> and somebody's got to come up on top. But really, coming out on top means you're coming down. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's like really funny. So the losers are actually the ones, when they meet other losers, that are creating this <laughs> biggest drama of shit in this world. <laughs> the winners, they just go away and win and, you know, look looking good and always you know, having to look the right way. See, that's that's the, the curse of, of being the winner, if you can call it a curse, is you must always look good. You must always do the right thing of other standards, not your standards, other people's standards, the majority standards of whoever you're hanging out with. 
So they're both kind of a curse and, and you can have, but you have fun with the looser part and like, I can be more looser than you can, you know? So, <laughs> and the no count, you don't even look at it. And that's, so that, they're having fun. <laughs> or not or not like yeah. well if they're like me and touch themselves for being no count it's like yes so actually let's let's run a, a clearing here and it's the access consciousness clearing statement we use for everything that comes up with stuff um that doesn't work for us we can clear it and i'll put it in the description too um if you haven't seen these Monday Matics before, it's the Matic Wand. So everywhere that you have made yourself wrong for being you and being strong and standing strong, will you destroy it and create it all? Yeah. Right, wrong, good, bad, pot, pock, all nine shots, boys and beyonds. And everywhere you thought that you don't mean anything because you actually don't mean anything you're just observing everyone <laughs> which is such a mean thing to do when we're trying to take a fight with you <laughs> oh, everything so that is, will you destroy and uncreate it all <laughs> yes <laughs> right wrong good bad pot pock all nine shots boys and beyond and, and i'm sorry is... for the effort but <laughs> i just had to come on <laughs> three meanings are mean Mean means several of things, and it's a meaning of it. So how does it get any better? So there is this clearing I used in the last episode we had too, where I was bringing it up. So everywhere you have avoided being a winner and being a loser while defending being a winner or a loser. That's not for you, Christina. Will you destroy and uncreate it all? Right and wrong, good, bad, pot, pock, all nine shirts, boys and beyonds. And everywhere you avoided being that infinite being that nobody counts. So you could defend winning or losing. Will you destroy and uncreate it all? Mm -hmm. Right and wrong, good, bad, pot, pock, all nine shirts, boys and beyonds. And we all have the capacity for all. We all had that possibility. I would just like today to put out the question. How do you function? Just for you. What, where do you function from? Winning? Losing? Or you just don't count? Everything that doesn't allow you to perceive, know, be, and receive what that is for you, will you destroy and uncreate it all? Yeah. Right, wrong, good, bad, pot, pock, all nine shots, boys and beyonds. And when you know this, now you have the choice to choose either of the three in every given moment. Because the next moment you may choose something different, but you have choice. Before, you were just blindly, unawarely acting out with whatever was near you. And now you can have choice if you're willing to ask yourself that question and look at it. Awesome. And it, so it's like really it's it's all about the judgment for me it's all about the judgment when i f first heard this like the the winner the loser and the now count it was what <laughs> what <laughs> of course a winner i want to be a winner <laughs> this is what you be in this here <laughs> like if you're not a winner you're a loser and what is a no count <laughs> It's even worse than the losers. So. But what, what if we wouldn't have to judge it and just 
be aware and and see if it works for yeah. us and if it doesn't work just do something else yep yeah so if i'm challenged by something you know i haven't wanted to look at in my life <laughs> and i'm challenged by somebody who says no that's <laughs> that's wrong and i want to be right here goes that's the thing i'm just challenged about something i haven't looked at and i'm unaware of it if they challenge if they can trigger put it put that push the trigger point if somebody can push the trigger point at me it's because there's something they they found that big red button that i put on top where if you push it <laughs> i react and i'm gonna win this battle <laughs> because nobody pushes my buttons <laughs> and and there's no question in there it's just that button pusher. Yes. But if, but if I know this reaction of oh, now I am win. I'm doing that winner thing again, and I know what that is to win. I have to look right, and I know that doesn't work for me. Or if I lose, then I have to be pathetic hurt crawl down in a hole and that doesn't work for me either i found like experience <laughs> <laughs> then as soon as i notice one of these energies that i like i've been willing to look at every time i could like what did i choose here okay this is what i choose in here then one day i will know that hey don't give up me and don't have them give up them. And they can push all the button they want. It's just a button. It's not red anymore. And I may even like see what's behind the button from that space. Yes, and uh, um, like in in such such moments, <laughs> mm -hmm. um, I usually just go asking, um, well, first, great, great, I have this awareness, how does it get any better than this? So what do we take for next time to even be faster with this awareness that there's something triggering or whatever is going yeah. on so I can change it? And the yeah. next thing is, I, I actually don't look into the why, I, I may look into what is this, but for me, it's like even faster to change it if I'm really, mm -hmm. but I, I really do have to um, willing to be that. I, I just go and ask, um, what would it take for me to change that? It's, a, yeah. it's an ask and it's a demand, like I be everything or do everything to change that, whatever it is. Sometimes you can't define it. Sometimes you may go into your mind and looking for the right answers to come. That's yeah, it never, goes around. That's never helping. So, so just to just to cut that thing, I just really I I I go the short way and going. Okay, no matter what. I change that. Yeah. But that's only me because I don't like to do the long way. Hey, I'll have that. <laughs> <laughs> the shortcut, not the long way. Yeah. And I've, yeah, been actually, taking, I've been taking a long way. I've been around the world several times to do this. <laughs> <laughs> no, I actually just found that that is something I know from a long time ago, like looking into something instead of looking at something, <laughs> looking into something, going into the rabbit hole, like um, having those mind and, and mind ways going on. So 
So that's, I, I know that I tend to do that now, not that much as I did. So that's my personal <laughs> shortcut has to be willing, but that's a choice too. I have to really be willing to change it. Thank you so much for this perspective because you are well versed in it. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yes, there's a lot of triggers. <laughs> yes, there will there will be triggers, and you are not wrong. <laughs> you are not Hooray. right, but you're not right either. And that's the thing is like nothing is wrong or right except from if we make it, and then we have to fight it. So I I just love what you said, and I just want to say, no matter how screwed up I have been, when I have I have had a chat with you. I always come out greater because you don't let me give me up, but you show me not to give me up by not giving you up. Like you will not buy anything I say. You would go, hmm, what question can I ask here? <laughs> And you may not loudly, but going in, it's clearly you're asking, oh, what question can I ask here? Or what can I be here? Like you said, to change this, I'm, I'm just like, okay, if I have to sit there and beam while she chatters <laughs> until and be beaming um, at some point. I'll in my in the middle of the chatter, I'll be asking the question of what else is possible. <laughs> and then you have an opening to not attack me, but just be there with me as I explore what else is truly possible when I- Oh, know. yes, and that's what you're doing. You explore, <laughs> you go yeah. and explore what else. So facilitating is easy with you because you, <laughs> you do it just <laughs> <laughs> Yes, and that's another thing to acknowledge. So if you acknowledge, so if you're willing to get out of the right and wrong and you go in and you look at you, like, oh, if I don't give up me, who will I be? One of the things I have chosen, I, I, I be everything I've chosen to be. So every single choice I make creates what I be and what shows up in the world. And that's a great conversation. It gets, it gets to be a long conversation if we go that way, but we have a, a whole world to cover. So <laughs> we may want to do that another day, but it's well, like that's not, just yeah. another quickie we're doing right just, now. Just another quickie, we're so quick <laughs> at this and Monday magic is a long day magic. So <laughs> it's only, it's only Saturday. <laughs> it's only Saturday. <laughs> It's not Sunday till another or Monday or Tuesday till another hour or two. So, um, yeah, we're pre just so you know, it's been pre recorded. You get that now. Because <laughs> because Jenna can't do Monday, she's having a bars run. So I had to catch her on another day. Um, thank you for that. So, no, but the, the, the me thing, the, the, Staying with me, being with me, and looking at this. Um, one of the things I've chosen is I to be a facilitator. And that includes every time something comes up in my life, something that's not working, the facilitator just turns on. And my facilitator goes, yappity, 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 yap. And 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 words come out of my mouth until the words there, that one, that word I was looking for that triggers it, where I hit my own red button and no, there it is. That's the one that will change it all. And yeah, and a note count would be that space. <laughs> awesome. That space of saying, yeah, yeah, you go, girl. You just go. Rabbity, rabbity, rabbity. <laughs> and no, there you got it. And then they're there to say, yes, you got it. <laughs> well, that's that's awesome to have that space for yourself. Like, what if everybody could have its own facilitator? <laughs> yes. 
its own space. Yeah, its own space. Like for this. It's and if you're like me, when I when I met Access Consciousness Tools for the first time, I had no clue in my world what a facilitator was. I was like, what's Either. a facilitator? Why don't you call it a teacher? No, no, facilitator just means one who makes it ease. So, um, yeah, I chose to have be one who makes it ease. And the new choice I have created lately was for me. <laughs> you know, maybe I should include me if I want to have relationships work with, with everybody else. Yeah. Stop. Yeah, well, that's actually the first place you should start. Start at home. And Christiane has been very patient. She's known me at least for six years now. <laughs> She's been very patient. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you well i love every single conversation we have it's always <laughs> creating more <laughs> even even if i'm in a <laughs> rabbit hole or you it always creates more <laughs> yeah so if you have any questions about this you can put it in the chat when we post it you can you're welcome to put it in in the in the remarks in the chat or um if you want to have these tools you could show up at a foundation class and there's oh yeah do a foundation it's a four-day class and it's not only about winning losing and no counts but it's just one of the little things that you get facilitated with and that means all your relations to anyone your dog your cat your child your spouse your parents Mm -hmm. um yeah what else is possible and uh, you can all find them on the access consciousness page every every class that's up it's all over the world um facilitators facilitating this and follow your knowing what will work for you who would be fun to be with uh and be facilitated by follow what you know what's light what lightens you up is what works for you so thank you for today and we'll see maybe you'll be in danish next week who knows <laughs> <laughs> well then not with me <laughs> no it is mondays you know normally <laughs> but thank you christian for coming and thank you for inviting me <laughs>